We've seen this on your social media feed. Some parts of the country, including our area, are getting ready for a sky show, the Aurora Borealis. Yes, the second time this year we're seeing the northern lights this far south. Let's bring in the chief to explain why we're seeing this again, Top. Well, you know, when they rate these uh, magnetic storms on a scale of one to five, this is a four. So it's, it's a pretty intense uh, uh, solar storm. So check this out. These are pictures of the northern lights in Bluemont, Virginia. It's western Loudoun County, uh, taken by Daniel. This is about 1.30 this morning. Uh, you also saw a few meteors as well. I mean, that's pretty, that's pretty spectacular to see both. Now, we asked Sean Dahl with the Space Weather Prediction Center to explain how these solar storms impact us. That activity is a result of interactions with the solar wind, as we call it, that which is what we're measuring when these CMEs come through space, because that affects, affects some of our technologies that we rely upon, such as the power grid, aviation communications, uh, GPS accuracy, and other such things. Now, the storm was not quite as extreme as what we saw back in May. Remember, they were seen as far south as Florida. Uh, won't likely be as strong tonight, but you could go out and maybe still see a little bit of a glimpse. We'll come back. We'll talk about how long our break from heat and humidity lasts. Ah.